Hey guys, you know who it is and today I'm going to teach you how to draw Thor from Thor Ragnarok only his face so it's going to take a while so bear with me starting um you have to start it by drawing a line like so and it comes out like this and goes down like this that's his cheek now for his chin it's square fairly square with a bit of curve and it's going to go up in an obtuse angle and up like that um this is where his ear is going to be so curve like that we'll finish that later but for now this is the eyebrow and it's going to be short cause it's looking that way like that and his nose is going to extend from right there goes in comes down at an angle and curves like that for his nostril it's just going to be an upward curve like that and shade it black you done for the nose i mean now his eyes are going to be a bit tricky because that's what separates him from Doctor Strange in this movie I mean the faces too but they're almost same going to make a line like that and down like that and back there and a curve underneath now that's his iris or pupil or whatever now for the second eyebrow and the eye I'm going to curve like this and this eyebrow is going to be like longer than this you can just be like you can shade it like that no problem yeah it's going to come like that and repeat what you have done here only um it's going to be a bit bigger here cuz he's looking that side make sure to draw these both at the same angle cuz if you don't that makes him look cockeyed and line underneath And now um before you start with the mouth you have to draw the mustache and it's not too thick it's only a group of light lines and comes down like that and goes in
take it up and bring it down and lightly shade it that's his beard you don't see much of the upper lip um, it's going to be covered by the mustache but basically his mouth is going to be open so like that and color it in and his lower lip Oh, and I almost forgot. Add a line here. Makes it look good. Also, bring it a bit closer to the lower lip. Yeah, like that. Now for his hair, it's really short. Not like all the other movies that we've seen him in. That's his hairline and it ends right here, I mean it doesn't end but his hair is parted so start from here and just goes like this. Just random lines really but be careful to maintain it short I'm um, actually you have to go a bit higher um, kind of like maybe this height yeah this height is going to be okay random lines like that really spike I mean it's different from all the other Thor hairstyles he's lost his long hair to be honest I actually like this version better and a few lines to indicate the direction of the hair let me just zoom out yeah his neck is going to start from here kind of And he has this red lines, I think it's blood or something that go all the way like so. I'm just going to lightly shade it and you can add some details for the ear like that
now for his armor let's just watch carefully that's his collar and a curve like that like so um you have to draw two circles like this roughly about this size actually this forehead is not wide enough yeah that's better some hair like that so there's a line that comes like this and a shoulder plate just some scratches over there cloth he calls it a cape but nah it isn't worth to be a cape shade a bit and the hair and you're done